So give a name, we'll make an arrest. He definitely said that. Um, but in any event, uh, uh, she would not uh, she would not cooperate. She didn't want to. But, but Detective Sandanaga, their domestic relations or domestic violence uh, person, said they should have done an incident report no matter what, even if they decided there wasn't a crime. Because domestic violence it has the cycles, they come back, and it's good to have the record for the next time that it might happen. So she said they should have under the circumstances. She was never abused. Didn't. And she also said that when they put verbal dispute only in those calls, it is a code that they use, and you'll see that it's twice on that call report, so they, to, to say that's why we didn't write a report. Oh, she um, needs to shut but up. But anyway, whether the police officers you know, forgot about it two months later when they were first asked about it, whether they just decided she's never going to press charges, and you'll see on the call report they're insisting that to the second set. It doesn't make any difference. The point is, this is still false. This statement is still false because Amber did everything but try to press charges against Johnny Depp. So they go away. Uh, and the testimony is that Josh and Amber and Rocky cleaned Liar. up because they have dogs. So they cleaned up a lot of the glass and the wine and, and those types. They had no idea the second police officers were coming by. And they certainly didn't call them. And they certainly didn't talk. They never talked to a publicist. She did talk to a lawyer who gave her advice. And that's why she wouldn't tell them you know, anything. She said, I'm not going to cooperate at all. Um, so the second one's coming. You saw that. You've got the video cameras in there. You see, there's no effort by them to try to get now these officers to press charges against Johnny Depp. Just the opposite. Josh Drew doesn't want to even let him in the place. Uh, they come through quickly. Everything's fine. They wave. Everything's fine. Are they trying to press charges against Johnny? No. They're not trying to do anything. They're trying to get him out of there, which makes this statement 100% false. Was it made with malice? Absolutely. There's nobody that thinks that Amber tried to press charges that night. Johnny knew that. But the other thing that's very helpful and what you should look at is Defendant's Exhibit 772 and 773. Because once again, the next day, Johnny apologizes to Amber. He says in two different We believe you, Johnny! 772 and 773, um, he says, my profound apologies in one of them, and my apologies are eternal in the other one. What is he apologizing for the next day on May 22nd if he didn't know Look at her he with her fake all ass. those things? And by the way, remember Isaac Baruch even remembers the wine in the hallway. The police, None of the police officers remember the wine. And that's because they're busy and they got a zillion other things going and they didn't remember this call two months later when they were asked about it. Um, so that's, that's the next one. Um, so clearly, that's 100% false. Clearly, they knew it. Clearly, there's malice in making that statement. They're trying to suggest that she's manufacturing evidence with her friends to try to frame Mr. Depp. Nothing could be further from the truth on that Amber one. Amber Turd. She did not want those police officers to press charges. I hope Carmen gets you. Let's go to the third one. Oh, and let's talk about the makeup just for a moment while we're going to the third one. This makeup thing, fresh face, natural. These were Adam Waldman planting these when he when he talked to the ECB people. Oh my you God! Remember this, the testimony here. We this kept again. Asking, so did you talk to Mr. Waldman? Did you talk to Mr. Waldman? Mr. Waldman was trying to plant in all of these people's objection, lives, Your Honor. Somehow she wasn't. Did he approach? Yes. Yeah, shut her down. Freak. Oh, I hope Camille gets back on the stand. So I didn't say that any of the witnesses admitted that Adam Walton planted that. I'm saying he planted it. That's me arguing the planting. And that's because oh, it's all shut the same up. she wasn't wearing any makeup. She was natural. She wasn't wearing a stitch of makeup. Every one of them says it. It's the exact same thing. But why would you say that? She's an actor. She's not going to go outside her house you know, without putting makeup on. And if she has bruises, why on earth, when she's been covering them up for four years, why on earth would she not put makeup on? If so Johnny did all that, then why up? she didn't end it why up in a Texas would she chair? she not want to cover up those bruises? It makes no sense. But you know what? You guys saw her here. This is lies. Um, you saw Amber on the stand. There were days where she didn't wear eyes. Lies, lies, lies. A lot of people think that she's not wearing makeup when she doesn't have mascara and, and eyeliner on. 
she has different looks and some of them are with eye makeup and some of them are without and people misunderstand especially people that aren't that good at makeup and a lot of men frankly um, go oh that's then she probably doesn't have makeup and that's where that mistake happens but you heard her testimony and you heard her makeup artist te testimony saying she doesn't go out of her room without concealer and foundation she knows how to put these things in and you decide defendants exhibit 155 and you'll have the actual thing in there that's the type of everyone power said to use. that johnny so depp never heard her puts on for the different days of bruises this is a woman she who did it to herself years, did everything she could to cover up anybody knowing anything about this abuse do you honestly think she she's a gold digger for the week with her bruises exposed of course she's not look at her with her fake now, self Let's go to the third one. Trying to make herself look, oh, believe me. And this is oh. the abuse hoax. He says, we've reached the beginning of the end of this current abuse hoax against Johnny Depp. Now, the, 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 obviously, the defamatory meaning of that is that Amber's created an abuse hoax. But there is no abuse hoax. I yes, it is a hoax. All of the evidence because Ben did a beautiful job. She is lying. All of those different things. I should I know. For you, and that is remember Bonnie Jacobs, the therapist. Dr. Hughes and Dr. Spiegel testified about Bonnie Jacobs' notes. As